Hello everyone, thank you very much for joining me for today's snapshot. Today we're going to be talking about Apple's 5G launch and how to trade it. But before we do that, please take note of the following important information. Please note that CFDs are high risk products and that you should be completely aware of the risks that they pose. Also, please know that this is a general market commentary only and does not constitute investment advice. Finally, these are our sources of information. Okay, thank you very much for that. Now, Apple has scheduled an online event for tomorrow, which is the 13th of October. It is due to launch its first 5G enabled iPhone. The rollout is late this year, but the devices are expected to be in stock for the holiday period. 5G networks continue to be built and rolled out by US carriers. And we note that the event is a virtual event and begins at 1 p.m. Eastern time with the tagline high speed. Four new iPhone devices are expected with all four 5G enabled. Let's take a look at the chart. And what we'll do is we'll start off with the daily, the daily chart first. All right, and uh, what you can see is that today is a terrific, terrific blue candle. So there's a lot of emotion, a lot of excitement ahead of the virtual event tomorrow. The candlestick is above its black 20 day simple moving average and that simple moving average is moving in that northeasterly direction. Take a look at the RSI and the RSI is comfortably above 50. That is the bullish side of the oscillator. Let's just go down to the hourly chart and you'll see that Let's just move it over here and you can see that the hourly chart is overbought. Now, perhaps that is um, signaling some sort of normalization, a pullback. And if that's the case, one would need to assess to see if it is in fact a dip in an uptrend. Let's end off with some key takeaways. Apple is expected to launch four new iPhones that are 5G capable. The virtual event is going to start at 1 p.m. Eastern Time tomorrow, 13th of October. The short-term charts are overbought, but pullbacks will be compelling. I hope you found this snapshot useful. If you did, please click on the subscribe button below. Thank you very much for joining me today, and I look forward to speaking with you again in the near future.